So let's take a closer look at Submagic's B-roll footage. This is a whole lot of fun, especially for the fact that you can really decorate your videos to make them pop a little bit more. I've already uploaded a video, I've gone through all of that stuff, but I'm getting ahead of myself. In case you haven't gotten to try them out, I will leave my link in the description. You can use them for free, so you could always follow along with me if you like. And if you want to upgrade, I will have my coupon code in the description. It's going to be island, I-S-L-A-N-D, and you can save a good amount of money that way. So. Here we are with B-rolls and it's very simple to use, very straightforward. So we're gonna go through and take a look at this and where would I wanna add this? Probably in the beginning, I'm not gonna wanna add it because I want people to see my face. So if they're like scrolling through TikTok or you know anywhere else, they can see me. And it's gonna be a little bit more of facial recognition, obviously. So I'd probably start off right around here, six seconds in. This reminds me of golf. So what we can do is simply click on the word where we wanna find B-roll and we can search B-roll. Obviously, this is gonna be video. There's GIFs, there's images, and you can split into a new line. So say this was in a longer sentence, you can just separate it so we're only having golf when talking about it. Nevertheless, let's go with B-roll here. And we have golf, we can always load some more here and just take a look at them. Let's see, load more. And let's go with something like, I mean, not a big deal what it is, right? Let's go with this one. Let's do apply. And what we can do is center it so that it looks better. So we have the positioning. There we go. Looks good to me. Nice and centered. And there's also, we can do film burn, film burn too. There's going to be a few others. Film burn usually looks kind of funny here, but I think overall it looks great when you actually utilize it. I like that one. So I'm going to go with apply. And just like that, we have added that there. So every time I'd go to take a practice swing, I would just go through, it'd be effortless. It looked like a professional swing. So let's do this swing. Now, keep in mind, just because it has swing, exactly what I was going to talk about, like it's probably going to have people on an actual swing. But if we do a little bit better, let's do golf swing. There we go. So that's exactly what we're looking for. So something like, could probably just do this one and apply. And what I can do is just center it once again, do film burn. I like film burn, as you can tell. Okay, I wasn't thinking, I'd go through and line up to the ball. Am I going too fast? Am I moving too slow? Am I hunched over? It's like a robot swing. I'd shank it, I'd screw it up. I had screwed up. So like, let's just do this. And what you can always do is say like, you wanna get the main idea here, obviously. So like, let's just do fail, right? Fail is a good way of saying that. You know, something like this is perfect, like someone's upset. Let's go with this. And let's center, of course. <laughs> there we go. Apply. I was thinking too much in the beginning. You gotta just stop thinking so much and just do it. So, okay, pretty cool. That's gonna be the video aspect of it. Now there is the the part where you can do magic B-rolls. Now keep in mind, I prefer doing them myself just for the fact that there's gonna be a lot of overlap in words where it's not always going to say, for example, remember we, we chose swing before? If you go with swing here, it might be someone on a swing going back and forth. You know, it could be a golf swing. It could be a tennis swing. It could be a baseball swing, right? So there's a lot of different ones that you can utilize. So let's see. Then I'd line up to the ball. I'd think about too many things. How about this? We can do B-roll and we can do overthink. Okay, let's hit enter. Let's see, we can do load more. Okay, this one's not bad. Perfect, let's apply that. And let's move it so it's more centered. And we can do film burn, I like film burn, and apply. Now let me give you an example of one that we can do, let's kind of sprinkle them around, I wasn't thinking. Let's see, then I line up to the ball, am I moving too slow, hunched over. So let's go with digital. I'm gonna go digital marketer. Okay, let's go with this. I'm just gonna use this as an example. We can do apply. And what we do here is obviously the position, I'm gonna put this up much higher and we can make it bigger too, right? So it doesn't have to be all that big, just don't want it to cover me, right? So that'll be the one GIF we use in this one. Looks good. And I think that's just gonna about do it. So let's click on save. And one more thing, I'm gonna go with boost just to add in this. I like the AI hook and title. So in the beginning, it's gonna auto generate for us. Just to kind of throw this in there, the fastest digital marketing tips. Let's regenerate. I'm just going to do regenerate until I find one I like. Great. Stop thinking and just do it. Let's see. Does green look a little better? Yellow or red? I like green here. Let's actually move it down so that the green pops off of my shirt. Could probably make it a little bit bigger. And perfect. I'm going to use that. So let's click on save. 
But now that we are done, I'm going to stop talking. And uh, what you can do is just, you know, watch and listen uh, when it comes to utilizing the B-rolls and, of course, the extra AI hook title. Let's click on play and hear how it sounds. Digital marketer, the fastest way to get started is to stop thinking so much about what you have to do. This reminds me of golf. Every time I'd go to take a practice swing, I would just go through, it would be effortless. It looked like a professional swing. Why? I wasn't thinking. I'd just go through, do what I know I had to do, and I'd be done. Then I'd go line up to the ball. I'd think about too many things. Am I going too fast? I'm moving too slow. Am I hunched over too much? I'd be like a robot swing. I'd shank it. I'd screw it up. I was thinking too much. In the beginning, you got to stop thinking so much and just do it. All right, great. So there you are. There was an example of having a video, not only with the auto captions, but throwing a few bead rolls in there as well to kind of add some spice to it. And of course, this one, I just added the AI hook title because I think it's a great way to help get more clicks in the beginning. If someone is scrolling through your feed and they see like, stop thinking and just do it, they understand what they're going to be getting from this. Or maybe it could be something a little bit more captivating, but that's why you have the regenerate option if you're going to be using the AI hook title. I like that separate feature. I know this is mostly about B-rolls, but hope you got some value out of this in terms of when it comes to using your B-rolls. It's more about like sprinkling them in, you know, every now and then. I personally wouldn't use B-rolls all the way through because I want to actually show me a lot of the times, but in the background, they kind of break things up. Having those is pretty cool if you ask me. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. And of course, if you haven't gotten to try out Submagic, my link will be in the description where you can try them for free. And my coupon code is going to be ISLAND, I-S-L-A-N-D, also in the description if you want to save some money when upgrading to a paid plan. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video.